Hello and welcome to Broken Age! Last bit! Now, I'm not doing it live this time purely because it takes so freaking long uh, so I will be cutting this down to a more simpler size if it takes a really long time or uh, it might end up not I, I did a little checking on what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, and... I am about to come down there and unplug you! You can unravel me like a sweater, but it will change the course we're on. The nav swath has been deployed. But I can take manual control of the ship. Not when I'm following Give me one the commands of a star chart. That's ridiculous! My advice is to just sit back and enjoy the trip. I, I have found out a few hundred yards left or right that he's really bit. ticklish by Even here. In my power, Captain. And that kind of navigational sloppiness is a slippery slope. I am about to come down there and unplug if we you. You can unravel me like remember. a but it will change the course we're on. The nav scarf has been deployed. But I can take manual control of the this ship. One. Not when I'm following the commands of the star chart. So this one is I so blue well, first. Who does? So the rules blue. were here before either of us. It's yes. not our job to question them. <sighs> we're doomed. Triangle downwards. Well, go Two around it then. We're under triangles fire. in opposite. But you know once the path is rolling, the ship follows only the red. It's Yellow out is of my control. next, isn't it? We are going to get so to bits. Surely that the is ship shields will protect us. There are no ship shields. We uh, threw the fusion orb out the trash chute. Excuse me. What protocol calls for the disposal of our There is no protocol for this situation. This is no territory here, okay? My advice is to just sit back and enjoy the trip. I am only asking you to steer a few hundred yards left or right. Just and the Even red one is that kind of navigational ours is a down. I am about to come down there and unplug you. To you can unravel me like a sweater. Separate it into the triangle. Okay. So let's cut all of these. Not when I am following the commands and of put in the heart. I don't make the one rules. because it makes it well, wave in the air. The rules so, were here before oh. either of us. So that it's probably not means our job to question them. That it'll be able to tickle the nap scar. Well go around it then. We're under fire. I would love to, Captain Volta. But you know once the path is well. I think that's the right terminal. It's out and of my control. Uh, so that. now I'm out of wire. Right. He should tickle. Hey! Yay! That is an extremely severe... Sensitive... Space Weaver, report! I'm experiencing severe... <laughs> what? What is it? Are you damaged? Stop! Stop it, please! <laughs> oh, hang on! I'm coming right down! My guns! <laughs> Good Excellent. job, little girl. You keep them both occupied for a while, okay? So, I should go out there. Oh, oh, Bella, watch my controls for a bit, would you? Our navigation bot seems to be malfunctioning. I shouldn't mm -hmm. be gone too long. Right. So... Huh. Didn't work that time. But it should have. Alex, did you disable my death ray? Hmm. Okay. Sneak 
in here. Right, so we need to allow. What is it? Tell me, space. Let's hope this isn't the self-destruct button. There. Uh, that that so should strange. allow Gary Grabber. to grab a hold. Let's go back through here. Now Shay needs to get the power up and running again. What we need yeah, is for him for to do a banging motion, because otherwise it doesn't do that. So this is why I've written down what that previous one was doing, because he was doing the whole torch waving back and forth. That should be the right sort of motion for him banging a drum. So let's change him round. So. It should be triangle to this point in separate directions. Half triangle to and complete Other angles triangle. Here. And up and down to three. That's all my wire. Does that Yes. Mm -hmm. I don't think that's how you play a harp. Okay. Still sounds drummy. So, we need our little drummer. Now nice. we're talking. That's very nice and loud. Oh. Hey, what's going on down here? Put those things down and be quiet, please. I'm trying to talk to Laruna upstairs and I can't even hear myself. Now put that down. Nope. Why? Still sounds <laughs> funny. Hey, you guys sound great. You should totally start a band. Yep. Okay. So that's gotten Alex preoccupied. If he can actually use this, no, no, he can't. That thing sure is giving off a lot of heat. Mhm. Mm now, uh, I can't use the radio. What was it next? Oh yes, grabby Gary? grabber. Come in, Gary. Gary grabber. It's grabbing time again. Work, Gary. It's an honor to be grabbed by such a professional. Mm -hmm. And then we go back to her. And start a major meltdown. Get out. Um, should we do something about that? Oh, I don't think we should touch the young man's things, dear. Okay. Oh. 
It's too late. The meltdown has started. Everybody, out! Run for your life! The other ship is melting down and it's taking us with it! How did that get out of their captivity? Over here! Mm. You have to jump! <gasps> jump, 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 jump! I'll catch you! Hmm. Mom! Dad! Watch out! Yeah, if he had jumped and then she's hey. gone, oh, mom, dad, and <laughs> just completely. Marriage. I thought you were a <coughs> baker. Yeah, I can do that too. <laughs> Shay! Mom! Jump, son! Okay, so... He's just a robot, so they don't give a shit, do they? Mm. Ooh. Did I actually make a band? Awesome. Oh, and they had a sport. It looks kind of weird and smiling. <gasps> old lady got beat. <laughs> I think that's the old lady. Or is that Marikai that they beat? Yeah. Uh, 
the development. The new. <laughs> Gus seems to have done well. Seems. Juicing up and everything. Really helped him. With his 3D hyper quick playing. That's cool. Uh, oh, cool. Nice. Crawfair. Ah oh, yes, the candle holder, you cut us. That's cool. Aww, it worked for them. Being cryogenically frozen. If only they'd let the other yarn pearls help. Oh, she knitted them back. Somehow. Oh, is that a brand new pearl? One with long arms. Hmm. Hardcore graphic design. Ah, oh, the two girls, the druids, and uh, he was let out of his jail. Okay, and they're making massive cupcakes. Oh, that is a big fish. That's that's quite some fish. Oh, cool! Parents got to be friends. He he managed to go home to his family, I guess. For his family. Ooh. Show. <laughs> still one annual bridge crossing festival. Mm. Okay, that's cool. So basically, what what Vela suggested of making a bridge across the gorge. Oh, he tried to knit. Well. Yeah, her idea, she was sort of like a really cool idea, and that's what happened in the end, so hey. Cool. Gosh. Oh, this game was long. It was difficult. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, they got the new cer cer uh, ceremony knife now. One that talks back to them. Hmm. Cool. Did they get together? Oh, has to be some weird love story thing. Maybe they just became friends. Hmm. Probably friends. I mean, she was just so taken with the uh, inflatable Shay, you know, saying that she was gonna show him off to her family or something. Ah, here's all the backers. Hello, backers. There's quite a few of them. Ah, oh, they've done it in alphabetical order, so it's not unfair to people. There's a lot of people. Hmm. I think they've sped up the credits a little bit because it's, <laughs> it's a lot of people. <laughs> a few interesting names there. Wow. Okay. Just continues onwards, I guess. It's a lot of people in A. It will go on to B, right? People with the B 
pays. Hmm. Oh, there we go. We're on to the bees. On to the bees. <laughs> Interesting uh, nickname. Okay, yeah, it's an interesting game. Uh, hoping for a little bit more on that end, considering that... The way how those scenes at the very end were kind of like... Cut, you know? It looked like it was about to give you a decision of some sort, and then it just goes on to the next cutscene section. So perhaps there was going to be something more to it or just the way how it was done for some reason. Mm. I don't know. Well at least we've gotten on to the D's. Quite a few people on D's as well. <sighs> Music is lovely. It's just when you're listening to one particular piece of music over and over and over again, it gets rather annoying. I have to admit that, you know? I think quite a few people had that issue. Oh dear. Sorry. Keep on yawning. <clears throat> According to Steam, I've been playing this for about 15 hours in all. Um, apparently, one of the achievements you can do is complete the whole game, Act 1 and 2, in one hour. So it's a matter of remembering all of it in order and getting it all done. It, it must be, he must be able to do that, but it means that you will miss out on quite a lot of the storyline, I'm guessing. Hmm. <laughs> Come on, we're on to the J's now. That's cool. We're getting there. It's nice to listen to all the music. It's kind of cool. I know many of you have probably uh, gone by now and just like, hmm. I wonder if she talks for much longer than what, you know, before. But yeah, I am. Hey. That was totally worth. One hundred dollars. Um, okay, cool. Um, you know, all all the money went to um, to them to ensure the game became as good as it was. You know, so I don't know if that was sarcasm or they really did mean that, but. Without all of these people, this game may never have happened, and the company itself may not have even sort of came to, you know, come to be, in a sense. So, um, you know, it's cool. I mean, we, we would have missed out on, um, quite a few games that they're producing and making and all that. The remastering of Grim Fandango might not have happened. 
and the ability to play that on so many platforms as well it's kinda cool you know so uh, yeah I'm get you know that hundred dollars you know went went a good ways yeah went towards some good people oh what happened to music listening to music is gone ah here we go back to the generic starter music wonderful okay we're on to the M's Ah, oh. ah, like me, I have a never been none. <laughs> nice. Um, I'm on the guess that's not his real name. Oh, unless that's kind of his nickname. Hmm. Glass eye, other pat. So many Patricks, look. Lord of the Monkeys, Patrick. To the R's. Nearly, nearly there, nearly there. You know, I'm getting there slowly but surely. We're getting there. Oh, people, people saying their love. Uh, double fine. Hmm. Um. It's cool. Uh, if I could, ducky. Uh, hmm. Buzz Funk. Ah, a duck. A few people. Oh, cheese plus. Sandman Sky. Underhill. Hmm. That's cool. Eventually, we will get to the end here. Yeah. Just a suck my podcast. Sunburnt crow. Mm hmm. The toxic fish. The spectacular Spider Man. Mm -hmm. Tom Hall. Oh, that one. Paris, the secret of Monkey Island. Tree whim. Hmm. Kinda get left at the bottom, these guys. Hey, we're onto the Z's. The rest of the backers and the slackers that made this happen. Thank you for playing. Is there a little bit at the end? Is there a bit at the end? Anything? Please? Oh. No? Okay. Well, I guess not. Oh, there we go. That is a that a then. So that was Broken Age. It's um see so this part eleven and the end. Um this should be cool, I'm putting this up in hopefully a couple of minutes. I've got my editing suite kind of working. Enough for it. So uh thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, uh, favorite? No, wait, because favorite's part of the like, uh, uh, comment. Because comments are really useful, and I can see if there's anything that I'm doing wrong, and anything I'm doing right. 
So uh, please do that. It really does help. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Goodbye.